what's important in all of this is for us to look at our own life and look at the balance between coping and changing. Because I've talked a whole lot about that being a massive imbalance towards the coping side. But the opposite, of course, can also be true. We can go through life changing way too much, causing damage, causing harm, causing chaos, or at the very least quitting things and bouncing out of things before they even have a chance to be successful, even have a chance to work. That's obviously not great. But the opposite isn't either, of staying with situations way too long, of whenever we're in a situation that we don't want to be in, of finding ways to rearrange our insides to try to be okay with it. 